was playing pool when I was going to bars at 18, I didn't know what the, like what I was doing. I was just kind of like banging balls and thought I was really good and super cool. But it wasn't until about like five years ago, I started working at a place that had a pool table in the office and then I joined like leagues and got all into it. So I'd say five years seriously, like trying to be good. Other than that, I was just trying to like stay on the table at bars. I got good at pool because I just started playing like every single day. Like I, I think that's the thing because you have to, like you can't really teach somebody what the point on the ball you're supposed to look at is. You can tell them like logically what it is, but until you hit a bunch of balls it doesn't make sense, right? So once I started like shooting every single day, like I always kind of could make some balls. Once I started shooting every day then it was like, oh I can actually hit low on the cue ball and it goes backwards or whatever. And once you start to kind of figure that out then it's just playing all the time. And also watching a lot of pool on YouTube. Lots of pool on YouTube. And I think pool, like, it's very complicated and there's a lot going on. So, like, no game is the same. You break them up and they always end up in a different place on the table. And even though you've seen situations before, you haven't seen exactly that layout on the table. So, it's a simple game with a lot of complexity, right? There's so much randomness just because of the break and stuff and just how, like, the table works. Like, little dust on the table might affect the shot. So every game is completely different and you never see the same thing twice. It's awesome. I just like games too. So I, you know, any game, in this game I actually like do in real life. So it makes me feel like I'm not just in my house all the time playing video games. I actually go out and do something, I'm good at it. <laughs>